I should thank you, Mr. Ford. By killing your only ally, you've saved me the trouble of killing him myself. You're next, Adams. You don't really think you can make a difference in all this, do you, Mr. Ford? The trust has been the bedrock of this country for hundreds of years. We have the reach, influence, and technology to restore America to dominance of this world, and we will not be stopped. Not by nations, not by armies, and certainly not by one lone man. Sometimes one man is all it takes. You know, you've been a great disappointment to me, Mr. Ford. I've refrained from killing you in hopes that you will see the error of your ways and join us. But you're unable to see past your childish morals and ideals, and that has made you weak. The fate of our nation is great. sanctum of this base. You'll find nothing down here now but your death. I've destroyed the elevator shaft, shut down all the conduits, and activated the base's self-destruct sequence. There is no way out. No matter what you believe, the fate of our nation is greater than the life of any one man or one place. Goodbye, Mr. Ford. Michael? Can you hear me? Prometheus, you're alive. In a manner of speaking. You destroyed my body, but while you were hacking the terminal, I uploaded my consciousness into the ASE. Just took me a while to get used to my new home. Adams has triggered a self-destruct and shut down the conduits. How do we get out of here? Hmm. We need to get power to the conduits. 
The facility is still running. Is there some way we can reroute power from the other systems? The stasis fields in the power substations draw the most energy in this sector. That might be enough. Hack the consoles with the ASC so we can route power to the conduit. We'll only have enough power to open one of these, and we won't know where it goes. much time. Find the console to a power source and hack it with the ASE. Come <laughs> on. 